So I am on Bridgewater Drive. We have a fleet energy absorbing terminal. That is a gating terminal, meaning that, meaning that when you hit it, you it absorbs energy, but then you can gate through it. Previously, there was a non-energy absorbing gating terminal here called the slotted rail terminal. It was installed improperly and um, the individual gated through and the problem that we have is, you can see, it went into this creek. The van flipped over and they drowned. And that guardrail worked exactly as it was supposed to. And we're very fortunate that we didn't get those same outcomes here. Hopefully that was enough energy absorption to slow the vehicle down but if we keep doing what we've been doing, we're gonna keep getting what we've been getting. There's a, I can't tell you about it yet. There's something on the horizon that would prevent this kind of dangerous gating. And my goal is to see one of those first terminals installed right here. enough's enough we cannot be putting out solutions that don't solve the problem that don't fix this gating terminals at this location that work exactly as designed laid to you upside down here having worked EMS I can't imagine just the desperation of trying to help this guy and knowing that you can't save him. Can't imagine the terror of being upside down in this water and then just finally succumbing and breathing in that water and just drowning. It's not necessary. There are solutions beyond what we're doing here. But if we keep on doing what we've been doing, we're gonna keep on getting what we've been getting.